welcome back to another pointless moldings um put on my remote so today we have this as you can see it's purple um it's another ashtray and it took some time for me to get this one done because i was having a couple difficulties with like um actually this is the first one that i actually tried to like freehand with like the mixture so i wasn't sure if like it had enough like parts to it instead of like actually measuring it don't ask why but anyways we're gonna see what this looks like when it's um out um but yeah since it didn't um set the first time i had to go over it again so i measured the mixture and then i went through it this one i already started um separating so i did my soap and everything already and it's pretty easy to come out i think maybe but you know watch me struggle with it a little bit let me just get the camera angle and we'll be good all right give me a second let me switch angles okay so here we are purple it looks like some ears might still be a little bit sticky but this one is like for me personal just like playing around see what i can do what's different um purple is not one of my favorite colors but i know quite a few people who love the color purple so i'm sure someone out there will like it and i was okay with the edges on this one coming over a little bit um, i was trying to get it to go all the way around so i might go over it again with a different um mold just to make sure that you know we get everything how it's supposed to be so all my sides are good oh and this is where we are we got our nice shiny purple we got some flowers in here we got a light color one and a darker one here and on the back we have some little beads and sequins it's 3d on the back also so we can actually like sit on you know a surface like elevated a little bit and yeah this is all the stuff that's in the back and this is how it looks in the front and this is what it is i am genuinely excited about this i love how crisp the edges are like something about the edges just make me so happy <laughs> um but yeah sequins glitter some flowers and a little bit of patience and here we are see it's nice don't you i might end up I don't know if I want to keep the edges so you can see it here. I think I might cut them off because it doesn't go all the way around. It's like two whole sides and like a smidgen of like a corner. So I might, I can't decide if I like the full edges more or the smooth edges. Like I can't decide, but I'm sure someone will have a preference when they order theirs. So we'll make them based on preference. Um, I don't know. That's all I got for now. And yeah, see, it's like we're good to go. It's so smooth. I love how smooth it is. I love, <sighs> I love this. But yeah, so I'm going to have to go over this again. Like I said, I don't know if you guys can see like my fingerprint. If you, I don't know if you can see it. But that means that it's not um, properly mixed right here. And like what's the other one is that it and then like somewhere over here but that might just be residue from no it's right here so right here and right here i need to go over a little bit just like with a paintbrush with the mixture on it evenly um measured and yeah you guys can see the glitter and all the other stuffs in the back and this is how the front looks Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. What are you doing? And come on back for more. Make sure you watch all the unboxings, all the unmoldings, and everything else that we have here on the YouTube channel. Make sure you listen to the podcast. And if you are not already subscribed, go ahead and do that. We are Pointless Talks on all social streaming media outlets, platforms, etc. So give it a chance um take a minute or two you know i might make you smile <laughs> and yeah thanks for watching and come back for the next one <laughs>